Hello, good people of the internet. Welcome back to more Resident Evil 2. We last left off in the sewers with Ada. And Leon's been shot. And then we killed Leon. Wait, what? I don't remember that part. <laughs> uh, remember how I uh, pointed the gun at Leon's head and I was like, it would be funny if uh, Melody uh, just added a gunshot noise and then cut to the credits. Well, she did that. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Yeah. So anyway, Leon's dead. So we're we're playing as we're playing as Ada. Um, I was just telling Red Kuni. They just announced a Resident Evil Four remake, so I don't know who the protagonist is going to be <laughs> if he's dead right now in this timeline. Yeah. Yeah, I was actually just about to say that. So they uh, we're recording this the day of that state of play that showed Resident Evil Four. Wouldn't it be funny? Yeah, and, and somehow I was living under a rock today and I hadn't heard that there was going to be a state of play despite me being an avid uh, PlayStation gamer. Bravo. And a fan of Resident Evil, and yet somehow both of those important dates are uh, missing. Uh, from and my brain, I'm like getting distracted by you zooming around the room. I'm looking for what to do, and clearly, there's a puzzle. It might help if my keyboard works. Uh, okay. So uh, the trick is, is that you, uh, there are three power switches, and you. Uh, switch to each of them and it directs power to each of the three things and so you got to figure out which sequence it is well the only yellow thing I see is right here and it kind of doesn't go anywhere well, then follow it uh, what do you mean just follow walk closer it? to the wall walk closer to the wall to get a closer look I would certainly do that if my keyboard wanted to work with me I see. I can't reach that. Still can't reach that. Aye, aye, aye. Well, I mean, I'm still alive. Oh, well, never mind. I mean, at least we know that there will be like a few sparse seconds before it goes to kill you, just in case we manage to solve it at the last second. Anyway, I was about to say, wouldn't it be funny if uh, by the time we get done with the original Resident Evil 4, we could just immediately play the Resident Evil 4 remake? <laughs> I feel like we should try to, we should try for that, actually. All right. Because uh, we've got Resident Evil 3, and then Resident Evil 3 Remake, and then Code Veronica, and yeah. then Resident Evil Zero. Yes. So we should have plenty and of... we can uh, add uh, the Outbreak. I, I was going to say the Outbreak games, but then I remembered that uh, Bravo. Outbreak had like this weird life, yeah. thing where they just were You'll like, hey, check it out, it's a sequel, but in actuality it's just I'm the first game, enough. but with the content that they really? didn't have time to add for the first and time yeah, around. Oh, this <laughs> is... And because of that, it basically just killed uh, the spin-off franchise on the spot because they're like, well, this sequel did not sell well, and it's like, no, no shit, it's just an expansion of the first game. Yeah, that is unfortunate. Yeah, it's not even like Left 4 Dead 2 where it's like, actually, no, wait, it is basically like Left 4 Dead 2. You get all the characters and maps from the previous game. Game, but then you get more. Oh, yeah. Uh, you're figuring it out. Yeah, sorry, you 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 cut off there. Uh, that bitch knows what she's doing. I'm not sure I why. Just, I think it's because you're screen sharing in HD. Am I?
I'm pretty sure I put you yeah. on a. Uh, I'm pretty sure I put you on a uh, 720, which is the lowest I can put you I don't on. Need... Oh, that's right. Yeah. For some reason, you can't put me on lower. Jesus, yeah, uh... you, I need like Discord Nitro or something in order to actually put you lower, which is weird yeah. that the lower options are uh, locked behind a paywall. You'd think it would be the other way yeah, around. Yeah, you'd think they would put like. 720 and 1080p on a paywall. Items don't carry over. I still want to kick them all up, though. I'm a completionist. Ow. Enough with this cat and mouse game. game I don't over. remember if I ever mentioned Evolve. this, but uh, I, I think I have, but I'm not Tell too me. sure. But. Uh, Annette's alive? voice actress is, like, a fucking so you can take anti vaxxer Trump supporter. Oh. Well, that's unfortunate. You don't yeah, know. and also really hilarious that an anti vaxxer is playing a umbrella job. scientist that is talking about the importance of a G-Fires vaccine. Well, you'd be surprised how many doctors and nurses ended up being anti-vax. Which is stupid, because that's their, like, whole job. Yeah, it's, like... Ooh, ow, having... ooh, ouchie. Yeah. Yeah, don't pull that out. Oh, fuck. Pulling it out is... It might stop, like, the pain of it being there, but... It, but it's also blocking it's also the bleeding. Once, yeah. Yeah. You pull that out, and it's like pulling the cork out of a shower drain. <laughs> yeah. Oh, uh, hey, look. Leon's alive after all. <laughs> we didn't kill him in the last episode. We also turned the brightness up, if you guys can't tell. I noticed when I was watching the recordings back, it was, like, really dark. Ada? <laughs> yeah. Uh, hopefully it's a lot better now. Yeah. It's so weird oh, that right. the script for this game seemed to go out of its way to avoid Leon saying Ada wait. <laughs> uh, they didn't want to recreate the meme, I guess. Yeah, and, like, uh, it, people were wanting the voice actor to, uh, like, say the line on a stream, but by that point, the original voice actor for Leon had passed away, and he didn't want to say the line out of respect for the actor, and it's just like, wow, we really missed our opportunity to say that line, huh? That is very unfortunate. Impressively disgusting looking. Well... It is a sewer. It's also a bit That's realistic. Nice There's the uh, storm drain section of the sewers where it just keeps track of all the water from the storm rooms above. And then when you get deeper, that's where the raw sewage is. Uh, lovely. Okay, so there's items here, but there's also a split path, so I'm probably gonna have to go down both of them. Well, it's a good thing this one's a dead end. Oh, and that was the only item. Okay, cool. Love that. Also, uh, there's a bit of an Easter egg, sort of. Uh, oh. Don't worry, it's in multiple spots, but, like, there's, like, these uh, dangling bits on the ceiling. It's in the tunnels of the sewers occasionally that suspiciously look like spider webs. Like, oh rather large spider webs all right despite giant spiders not being an enemy in the game and i've always i uh, interpreted it out of uh wish fulfillment desperation that it means that they do in fact exist you just don't encounter them what the giant spiders yeah ah uh by the way are there any raccoon bobbleheads in the sewers uh, yes, in fact, I believe there's one right there. Where? Or 
Oh wait, no, I think it's in the other path. So the one I the was- The one you just came from. Okay. I know there's one that's hiding out in one of the, like the out of reach sewer grates areas. Uh. Okay, if it's not here, then it's gonna be in another of the same type. Well, there's another gate over here as well. Might as well check it real quick. Yeah. Yeah, uh, my main gripe with the remake is that they seem to cut the more, like, weird and outlandish enemies in the game. Like the crows, the giant spiders, the giant moth in the Umbrella Lab. Well, <laughs> there was only one of that anyway. Yeah, but it made uh, for a pretty unique encounter. Yeah, I guess. Because it's not often you fight giant moths in any video game. Oh, hey. Cool, cool. I love how he just let out like this really raspy, like, you. <laughs> I didn't do that, the zombie did. That's what I was saying. Oh, uh, I hope I didn't miss that raccoon. Uh, it's possible it's down no, here. No, no, oh, no, 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 no. Into the raw suit. I, I oh, didn't. Don't I, worry. Uh, don't worry. Don't worry. You can get back up there. I wasn't. I didn't want to go down. I was just looking. Ugh, God. Uh, You'll be able to get back up there. Trust me. <sighs> yeah, that's still but, annoying but, though. Yeah, now you're in the raw sewage section. Look at all of that several thousand pounds of raw human feces. I'm sure this is sanitary. Yeah, uh, I'm sure it's about as sanitary as, like, trudging around in a sewer. Yeah. I'm not sure how uh, <laughs> Leon didn't catch dysentery or something while I'm down here. Like that. Okay. Do you have your magnum? Yeah. Equip it. Okay. Still looking for that raccoon. Hmm. Equip your magnum. I uh, my magnum is equipped. I'm experiencing low frame rates. Oh. Okay. Where's the sweet spot? Yeah, I remember this fucker. Um, no. Remember when, uh, Chief Irons got, uh, put with, like, a thing or whatever, he, he died? I remember that. Uh, yeah, okay. th this is the Hold on, how creature. do I put my knife? How do I put my knife again? Knife, knife, knife. How, how, knife, how, L1, how, how? L1. What do you mean, L1? I'm L1. playing on a keyboard! Uh, whatever the keyboard equivalent of it is, Jesus. I don't, I don't know what it is. Why didn't you practice before starting the recording? Hold on, I. Uh. Uh, controls, controls. That doesn't tell me which button it is. Go back. Okay, hold on. I oh, got I it. That's the. <sighs> Okay. How many shots does this thing take? You're just killing well, the other enemies. You need to kill the main things. Yeah, I know, but I shot it. Out. I shot it with a magnum like five times or more. You need to hit its weak spot. That. Oh. There! I wasted so much magnum ammo because I didn't know I was supposed to hit that. Oh, definitely. Ooh. And by the way, you're going to be encountering multiple of those. 
Why didn't you tell me what the weak spot was? I asked you and you didn't answer. I don't remember you asking before now. <laughs> Man, the music in Resident Evil 2 is so good to where you can literally use it for the remake and it's staying. So it's being just as atmospheric for the remake. Indeed. Director Owens, there are alarms going off over Ness. I don't know what's going on, but I can hear gunfire and I can't reach my uh, section chief. We're trapped. Please send help ASAP. Director Rowan, the situation is here is dire. Nest has been contaminated with the virus. It's unbelievable. The failsafe, sis the failsafe system didn't activate at all. Is the work? Uh, is this the work of outsiders? I can't imagine who else it could be. But why? Mayor and Kim are dead. I can't stop coughing. Why won't you answer me, Director Owens? You. It was you all. It was you all. Uh. It was you all. Uh. Two or words have never been spoken. I think he died before he could finish it. Well, then where is his body? How did the letter get here? <laughs> and there's no body. It, 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 it was a fax machine, which means that they just fucking hit enter mid-sentence. Can I look down this without actually... Hmm. Don't worry, you can revisit all these areas. I want to make sure I get everything first. Uh, the greetings from the CEO. Thank you for your interest in Knight's com construction company. Over the past 20 years, we have had the honor to work on the sewer system of one of our country's greatest cities. While never looting, losing sight of our two core principles of playfulness and superior industrial design. At KCC, we believe that just because our work is subterranean uh, doesn't mean our designs have to be subpar. <laughs> more refined than the queen, more polished than the knight, and as pleasant as a pawn, our work is sure to bring great victory to everyone involved. May we all meet on the field someday. Knights of Construction C Company CEO, World Chess Alliance Honorary Member, Raccoon Chess Club Honorary Advisor, Fisher Chess Lovers Guild Honorary Director, R.B. Fisher. Alright, the world building as to why uh, they use chess pieces. Yeah. Which honestly is the way to go for it, rather than cutting stuff because it seems silly. <laughs> Side eyeing the lack of giant spiders. <laughs> oh, hey, look, it's Birkin. And the rats. Oh, the rats are carriers of the disease. Yeah, and somehow they don't exhibit traditional T virus symptoms. Virus. I'll bet those rats spread it. Or maybe they do, I can't really fucking tell because they're rats. Wow, that's pretty rude. What if we have some rats watching us right now? <laughs> then they need to not drink tea virus juice on the floor. Well, you heard it here, folks. You heard it here first, folks. Raccoon, Red Cooney thinks that rats are gross. Uh, I'm sure that will go over well with the rat community. <laughs> I'm just kidding around. Anyway, it's time to end the episode, so we'll see you guys next time.